bamboo, they grow a lot, and they grow easily. I mean, uh, you'll see later our pool, um, well, our lack of pool, it doesn't have any water in it. Um, so I don't know where the bamboo really is, is grabbing water from. I mean, there might be a, an open pipe or something like that that has a crack in it somewhere in the foundation of the house because this bamboo is pretty close to the house so maybe it's drawing water from there but I mean uh, you know here's how it works out it's usually the plants that uh, my wife and I just couldn't give a crap about they're the ones that survive and do really really good and, and make it just fine but the other ones the ones that we really want to make it and the real ones that we really want to survive and do well those ones die real quickly and well, that's I don't know maybe we shouldn't maybe the the uh, solution to this problem is is to not do anything with them at all and just kind of uh, throw your hands up in the air and just kind of hope that uh, they seal up themselves but I don't know you know they die either way it seems it doesn't matter what we do but uh, so I'm cutting some bamboo back here uh, a little bit. The uh, I had the loppers out. The loppers really, really help because uh, I guess I could have used hand hand uh, cutters or hand clippers, those little little kind little gardening shears type of things that you can get over at the uh, um, over at the home decorating uh, places like Home Depot and Ace Hardware and then uh, uh, thing, other places like that. Um, but uh, I decided to use some uh, some loppers and loppers have a little bit more leverage so you can cut a little bit uh, bigger um, stem size stem sizes with them. Um, and I'm trying to cut down way down at the base because it doesn't it doesn't matter you know these these bamboo are gonna come back um, I can't let's see I think my wife cut these bamboo down to the ground um, probably what was it two or three months ago and we haven't done anything to them you know we didn't water them or anything and they're back at, I think they're probably about six feet tall right now, or, you know, five or six feet tall right now. So it's, you know, the, the, the really, it doesn't matter. If I cut them way, way down, it doesn't matter because they're going to come right back. No problem. And it's not like, see, the bamboo, what, what it was there originally for was some kind of visual protection in between the cars that go down the street, um, that go down the neighborhood street, and being able to see into our backyard and see the uh, see us in bathing suits and in uh, swimsuits and things like that. Uh, but um, since we don't have a pool, since our pool is not full of water, then it's no there's no real purpose there to have those bamboo really really high. So. And my wife, what she wants to do is she's making a compost pile. That's my uh, father. Father's um, uh, he passed away uh, a few years ago, and so I planted a willow in his uh, in his memory. And I think that he, well, that was his favorite tree was willow trees, was the willow tree, and so I. Um, I got that going on but actually my wife is the one that wa she's been watering that and taking care of that lately and it's uh, it looks a heck of a lot better heck of a lot better than whenever I was taking care of it because it's it's been there for about three years and it should be quite a bit bigger now than it is um, uh, than it is currently so I, I it probably should be up to the wall or something like that but it's not um, so anyway, that's the compost pile. It's the old, it's the old pool, uh, pool 
space and we're going to fill in that pool space anyway so we my wife just figured well why not fill it with compost you know with the uh, old leaves or dead leaves uh, there's some paper that you can compost too um, she's putting mostly stuff that doesn't stink uh, that isn't going to stink so like you know dead leaves and and uh, think and and uh, landscaping material that we're going to cut. Uh, she put cardboard boxes in there too. Uh, the, actually, she's going it, it, She's making it a lasagna type of type of compost. Uh, that means one layer of of uh, you know um, landscaping brush, and then one layer of of um, paper and cardboard and things like that, and then. Uh, one layer of, of uh, landscaping material. I think that's how it goes. I think it's, I think that's what a landscape.